Welcome back guys to my channel, I'm Alex, Italian guy, and today I will show you how to do one arm push up. So, the classic one, like this, we have two hands, we put the hands like this, we open our legs and we go down. We touch and we come back. This is the one arm push up. Let's start with the basics, like uh, what train to grab our chest, our arms, uh, anywhere, our body for be able to do something like that. For the one arm push up we need at least 20 classic push ups. So this one, we need to have at least one, two, three, four, five, six, 20 of this one. And a good condition of our shoulders. So for seat, try to do maybe something like this. If your shoulder hurts, you need to before fix your shoulder. Because in this movement, your shoulder will be involved a lot with your triceps and with your chest. Speaking about triceps, for do this movement, you need to develop at least five of these one. Put your hands like this. One, two, three, four, and five. And like this too. One, two, three, four, and five. Look easy, but it's not. Try at home and let me know in the comment if you're able to do that or not. Because if you're not, you need to improve your strength for reach the final moment. Speaking about technique, for learning to the best way that I experience in my life, in my career, like a coach, like an athlete, I can tell you is the feeling of the moment. So, let's put the hands like this while we are on our knee. So we put our knee down, not like this one. Knee down. We put two hands, like the classic push-up. But if you do the one arm push up, it can't be the hands like this. Do the one arm push up like this, just taking off one hand is like uh, for manga. You see that stuff in the cartoon. It's doable. You actually can do that, but it's kind of harder. So let's understand the concept and the feeling of the moment. We need to put our hands like this. We put one in the middle. We turn our hands some degree and we go down. That's the feeling. We open as more as possible our legs and we go down. Because low, and we go back up. So, for understand the concept, if you're not able to do that because you still have to drop your strength, you have to do that just with the eccentric phase. So just try to slow down the eccentric phase. And when you are like this, you just come back up with two hands. So, just do the eccentric phase at the beginning. Eccentric, 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 and fall down. Go back up, and like this, for at least five, six times. Three, four sets, four days and days and days. First week. After the first week, slash second week, if you combine your workout with this element of one up push up, you will be able to do this movement uh, almost perfectly. So what you have to do is the next level. So after the second week, then you're doing this, you can just put the hands like this, go on your legs, and try to do the eccentric phase with your feet like that. Eccentric, 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 and we go down. We come back up with two, Eccentric, 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 and we go back down. Same stuff. This one you have to do at least for one, two, dash three weeks because it's gonna make improve your arm. Option to do to both arms, like left and right, because if not, you will have a giant muscle in the left arm and a smaller muscle in the right arm. So let's say that you do everything perfectly, you eat right, you rest enough because the rest is so important, and you reach the fifth week in the best way possible you will be actually able to do your first rep after five weeks of doing this, if you are well trained and you're eating well. The step before, guys, of doing this with the hands behind the back is put it with the hands on the leg. If we put the hands on the leg, it will be easier. You may do with the arm on the leg, one, two, three, four reps, amon, so each means you do one rep. You do this for the sixth week, but rest enough because it's so important to rest for the rub and let our muscles develop. And after that, the seventh week, you will be able for sure to do this. This classic one arm push up. Perfect. Execution, perfect control. Of course, for grab your strength in our triceps, in our chest, in our body in general, you should follow other workout too, some chest workout, some back workout, some arm workout, for make your body grow as much as possible. For example, on Monday you train this movement plus a chest workout with the classic exercise, like this one, classic variants, uh, classic push up, uh, diamond push up. But for example, this one is amazing for uh, understand the feeling of uh, the one push up because we have the hands like this. So it's like when you do like this, it's the same concept. You feel the balance or a wide push up. You anyway have to do your workout of uh, chest and arms. 
Tuesday you do back, Wednesday you do uh, legs, Thursday you do arms, Friday you rest, and Saturday you finish all the muscle, you didn't finish, so like shoulder. All right guys, the video finished here, one like, one comment, subscribe to the channel, and see you in the next video.